There are two methods for washing the plate that have been found effective. They are using an automatic plate washer and using a multi-channel pipetter. Both methods will be demonstrated here. First, prepare the wash buffer. Pour the contents of the 20x wash buffer solution into a clean, sterile, one liter flask or bottle. Bring up to one liter with deionized water. Pouring the water into the flask is sufficient enough mixing. Automatic plate washing. Connect the prepared wash buffer to an automatic plate washer. Upon initial setup, run one to two prime cycles to make sure that the wash buffer is running through the plate washer. Two different programs are to be run on the plate washer. They are dispensing and aspirating 100 microliters of wash buffer three times and dispensing and aspirating 100 microliters of wash buffer six times. Make sure that the programs begin by aspirating the sample out of the plate before beginning the wash cycle. Prime the washer one time before each wash step. After washing, remove the plate from the automatic plate washer and inspect the wells for residual wash solution. If the wells appear to have some wash solution in them, Get a paper towel, set it on the counter, and tap the plate against the paper towel to remove the excess wash solution. Multi-channel pipetter washing. After each incubation, aggressively flick the sample out of the plate over a sink before starting the wash protocol. Pour the prepared wash buffer into a trough or tray. Using a multi-channel pipetter, Pipette 200 microliters of wash buffer into each of the wells used in the test. Aggressively flick the wash buffer out over a sink. Repeat this procedure three times for one type of wash and six times for the other type of wash used in this test. Once completed, inspect the wells for residual wash solution. If the wells appear to have some wash solution in them, get a paper towel, set it on the counter, and tap the plate against the paper towel to remove the excess wash solution.